Academy Award winning filmmaker Oliver Stone has written and directed more than 20 feature films. Among them, some of the most influential and iconic movies of the last three decades, including JFK, the 1986 Vietnam War drama Platoon, which won the Oscar for Best Picture, the 1994 thriller Natural Born Killers, starring Woody Harrelson, and a year later, Oliver directed Anthony Hopkins in the Oscar nominated Nixon. Amazing. Now he's back with an intense new drama that you're going to love. It's called Snowden, the real life story of CIA and NSA analyst Edward Snowden who leaked government secrets. But Stone wanted to give viewers a glimpse into Snowden's personal life and what he left behind. Take a look. We didn't come to Hawaii for you to heal, did we? There's never going to be a less stressful job out here. Look, I feel like I'm made to do this. And if I don't do it, then I don't know anybody else that can. It's like I'm, I'm on a trajectory that I can't turn back from. Oh my God! Hello, hello. Good to see you. <laughs> Hello, Kathy. There's Hello. no controversy ever in your life, is there, Oliver? There's nothing. Every you're just. You would like to probably do the sequel to Bambi, wouldn't you? Well, the Real Housewives of Greenwich. Of Greenwich, yes, New York. exactly. You two are great looking. Oh, today. thank you, honey. You had to talk Snowden into this, didn't you? You took a few trips to Moscow to, to accomplish yeah, that. Yeah, I was not chasing the news either. By the way, I. I'm, you know, you don't, movies take a year, two years, it's, mm -hmm. you, you don't chase the news, otherwise you get killed, right. something mm -hmm. comes up, so, yeah, we got to trust each other, and then the third visit, uh, we, we, did, we did it, we, and he helped us a lot, it was realistic, but at the same time, we checked all his stories with counter theories, and we followed the, the record, we talked to as many people who talked to us, ex-NSA mm -hmm. people, we don't know much about that organization. No, for well, good it, reason, I when suppose. When it comes to Ed Snowden, people usually feel one way or the other, yeah. either he's a patriot or yeah. he's a traitor, and this movie, I think, really opened your eyes to another side of him that you didn't know, like his history, how he signed up for the military after 9-11 yeah. and the series patriot, of other things, right, right. right? Very much so, he was a conservative and uh, more of a libertarian, actually, and then you know, Shailene Woodley plays a, a large role in this mm -hmm. change, uh, but he also goes through some pretty eye-opening stuff at the NSA, both in Geneva, in Japan, and ultimately in Hawaii. Uh, and he comes to oh, understand yeah, yeah. what's really going on. And we, mm -hmm. I don't know if you want to talk about that. No, well, pretty, we don't want to give away yeah. the movie. I, I, what yeah. I wanted to know is, when I asked, I think, I, somebody, mm -hmm. we've had a quite Shailene, a few of the cast think, yeah. members here the other day, and I read in a couple of interviews that you did, that there it's basically true. I, was, I always want to know how much on the screen is real. Right. And, and how much a dramatic dramatic license. dramatization of nine years of a man's life. You right. have to. You have to take have, a dramatic license. I get that. Everything that happened is basically correct. Mm -hmm. And uh, as, as Ed has himself said in an interview last week, he says it's as close to as real as, as, as you can get. And you actually, and I won't say how, but you, you actually, it was important to you that you have him be a part of it and well, we, you know that, that language that, that they speak of the things they do that's the sets that you build to make create this world you, yeah. you need to have an insider someone who's been there yeah when you look at everything that's going on in the world now Oliver with the hacking uh, at the DNC or now the Olympic records coming out yeah. I mean with all the research that you've done and everything you've looked into what is what is um, grasping you about these these leaks that we're seeing is this a, a well, no you're surprise. Seeing the, you're seeing the surface of events here. I mean, if, if you go to the film, you'll see that he's not only revealed the mass he's dropping, but he revealed drone warfare in more yeah. detail and also cyber warfare. And where did that start? Who, who was the first one who used cyber warfare? Mm -hmm. Our country. Mm -hmm. And we used it against Iran in 2007. So all the implications of what you're seeing now, these are, you know, first of all, you, who, is, who is to blame? Who do you say did it? You can never, it's very hard to prove. It mm -hmm. takes work and, you know, a lot of accusations have been thrown out there, mm -hmm. but uh, the truth is far more subtle than that. And it's going to everybody talking was actually, this weekend. I was watching Oliver on CNN, and when they were talking about the DNC hack, and one of the things that surprised yeah. me was you said, well, you thought that the, the Democrats themselves hacked themselves. Well, yeah, but, uh, you know, that's aside from the point right now, but, the, yeah. you know, there's an insider. Uh, there's an insider. Yeah. And a lot of intelligence people have told me this, but to who? And also, there's much talk about an NSA insider, another leaker, yeah. 
I got a feeling they're everywhere. Mm -hmm. yeah. But you know what I know for sure? <laughs> that's the nature of warfare. Yeah. I know. That kind of warfare. But there's some good news in the world, too, Oliver. What? Yes. You're turning 70 tomorrow. That's I want to wish you a very happy birthday. <laughs> oh, thank you, happy birthday. It's, a it's actually it's just a brilliant movie. <laughs> happy it, birthday. It opens in theaters tonight. Incredible. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.